What's poppin' guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to create video editing memes using Clipchamp's Giphy integration. So if you guys are excited for this video, make sure to hit the like button down below, subscribe if you're new, and as always, let's start creating memes right after the intro. Alright guys, so now if you click on the first link down in the description, it will land on this page. So right here we are on the front page where it says create video and if it doesn't say it, you can just go ahead and create an account real quick. Or if you already have an account, you can just log in, that just only takes a minute. So then we're going to click on create a video and obviously some GIFs are widescreen, but for this one or like any memes, we're going to create a square one. So we're going to go ahead and pick this one as a resolution. So that basically opens up the editor and what we need to do now is we need to insert a gif image and we need to also apply some text on it so then what we need to do is we need to click on stock on the left and then it says giphy on the left so if you click on there we can actually see a lot of gifs so then we want to basically decide what kind of gif are we making so let's say that we are creating a gif that our video has finished exporting of clipchamp but that is ready to place on social media so let's go ahead and click on this one so now what we're going to do is we're going to click on close on the left okay so if you click once on the gif it will actually appear in your media library so then we're gonna drag this one on top of our timeline right here and the cool thing is that this one is widescreen and we have a square resolution meaning that we already have some black bars at the top and at the bottom for the text so then what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and click on the text icon on the left and then we're gonna scroll all the way down until we can actually for example pick this one which has text at the top and text at the bottom so we're gonna drag that on top of our gif and then we're actually able to apply some text onto the gif so we're gonna drag this one to the beginning of the timeline and at the bottom, we're gonna also shrink this down until it's as long as the GIF itself. So then we're gonna type in, for example, at the top, we're gonna fill in when your Clipchamp video, and then we're gonna make the text a little bit smaller by clicking on transform. And then we're gonna make this one a little more tiny. And then we're going to also make sure to apply some text at the bottom. So then we're going to click on the text box and then we can just hold shift and press enter to go down a line. And then we can just, you know, fill out the rest of the text. So right now it says when your clip gem video and then we're going to add in at the bottom has finished exporting like that. Okay, so now that we changed up the font, it actually looks really, really cool like that. And obviously, you can also position your GIF as well if the text is a little bit, you know, overpowering. We can use like crop the fill, but I think this one looks actually pretty accurate. So let's go ahead and play it back. So I think this one looks very, very accurate. So let's proceed to exporting our meme. So we're gonna click on export at the top right. And then what we're going to do is, of course, pick our quality. I think, you know, the quality doesn't really matter that much because if you're going to place this on Instagram, or, you know, whether it's Facebook, you know, Twitter, it's going to compress it anyway. So the quality is not going to be the same as you export it. So we're going to just pick 720p, just like kind of in the middle. And we're going to hit continue. Okay, so it only takes a couple seconds to export because it's just, you know, a couple seconds long. So now what we can do when it's finished exporting, we also see that the length is only a second long. So that's why the size is like... 473 kilobytes. We can also copy the link, we can embed it to our website, send it to somebody on Messenger, share it on Facebook, but we can also download the video itself as an MP4 file to our computer so we can upload it wherever we want and we can also upload it to YouTube. So I would just click on download video and then at the very bottom it is just downloading immediately. So if you click on this one, if you open it up, this is basically what the GIF looks like guys or the meme, it is that simple. <laughs> this is how you create video memes in Clipchamp, you can use whatever you like. You can add in like different text to make your meme a lot funnier. So that's it guys. This is how you create video memes in Clipchamp. It is that simple and that's how to do it. So guys, that's it for this video. Thanks a lot for the continued support. Make sure to check out the first link down in the description to get started using Clipchamp. I wanna thank them for sponsoring this video. That's all I have for you guys today. I'll see you guys in a brand new video, obviously tomorrow. So I'll see you guys in the next one.